Survivor Outdoor and Archery is hosting its first ever Critter Roundup, hunting competition in Lee County this upcoming weekend. Participants will gather in groups and hunt nuisance animals like raccoons, armadillos, and opossums for a prize. But several people have expressed backlash surrounding the competition. One woman who owns Steadfast Wildlife Rescue and Rehab in Tifton says she's against it because it's the beginning of the birthing season for these animals. I'm busy trying to save the animals all the time. I have tons of babies in care right now. Raccoons, possums, owls, hawks, and tons of them that were orphaned or injured due to human error already. WALB spoke with the owner of Shiver Outdoor and Archery, and he says this is totally legal. So he's unsure why it's causing so much controversy. We do this with all hogs. We do this with coyotes. Uh, I don't know why this one just caught traction so much with people getting upset. We're not calling for the extinction or eradication of the raccoons or possum or armadillo, which we, we couldn't do it anyway as much as you want to hunt or trap. Sign up for the event is this Friday, April 5th. Teams can include three to four people and the entry fee is $100 per team. First place winners will get 70% of the entry plus $300 from Shiver Lumber. Each animal is one point and the team with the most points win. We've had complaints, people saying, oh, you don't eat them. Well, if they want an armadillo or a possum, I'll gladly let them have them. Or one of my guys at uh, Shiver Lumber, he is a coon hunter. He will be getting my collection of coons that I get Friday night, uh, Saturday morning. The owner of Shiver Outdoor and Archery says the competition will be held on private property. And according to the Georgia Department of Natural Resources website, opossums, raccoons, and raccoons on private land have no closed season or bag limits. He says they have spoken with the DNR to draft up rules and regulations to make sure no one is doing anything illegal.